An informed public means a strong republic, and Meet the Press is dedicated to that cause. This is the honor of my life. Meet the Press is one of the most important political broadcasts in history. And I just feel so grateful and humbled to all of those who built this amazing legacy. Hello from the North Lawn. Is the United States spying on its European allies? Is abuse of power an impeachable offense? Don't you need to recalibrate to try to work across the aisle with a Republican-led House? Does the president take responsibility? Does the president yeah. need to take the reins? And I'll be at the White House tomorrow, so I'll give you an update <laughs> when I ask him. It's one of five battleground states that he'll visit this week. I'm here with the rest of the press. How do you win this time? What's your strategy? I'm Kristen Welker of NBC News, and I welcome you to the final 2020 presidential debate. They see Washington fighting over a relief bill. Mr. President, why haven't you been able to get them the help they need? There have been questions about the work your son has done. In retrospect, was anything about those relationships inappropriate or unethical? Which candidate do you think is the strongest? President Biden reaching out to some of the winners. Are you taking this run seriously? Thank you so much for being here for this bipartisan discussion. What do you say to people who feel like Congress is broken? Is there any place for bipartisan agreement on this over the next two years? Why should voters believe you? I've been very transparent about everything I've ever done. Democrats control the House, the Senate, and the White House. So why aren't Democrats responsible for breaking their own promises to voters, Senator? Do you think that Donald Trump understands how much legal jeopardy he's in right now? Now. This concludes the latest edition of Meet the Press. This is Ned Brooke. This is Lawrence Bivak. Bill Monroe. Marvin Cal with Roger Mutt. I'm Chris Wallace. Here I got If it's Sunday. If it's Sunday. If it's Sunday. If it's Sunday. If it's Sunday, it's Meet the Press.